This video demonstrates how you can create remediation rules that help proactively identify and automatically resolve issues or threats that occur on the PCs. A remediation rule is a mechanism through which you can run a diagnostic script to identify an issue proactively and, if an issue is detected, resolve the issue using custom signed PowerShell scripts. First, let's see how to create a remediation rule using signed PowerShell scripts. Note, you must ensure that all the prerequisites are met before creating a remediation rule. For the list of prerequisites, see the Support Assist for Business PCs with Windows OS Administrator Guide. On the Connect and Manage homepage, go to Manage and Remediation Rules. Click Create Rule. Depending on the service plan, you can create and activate rules on the Create Rule page. You can also define the rule to run for specific sites and groups and at a desired frequency. Next, you must upload a diagnostic script. Optionally, you can also upload a remediation script. A diagnostic script helps identify an issue proactively, and if an issue is detected, the remediation script is executed to resolve the issue. Note. The diagnostic and remediation scripts that you upload must be signed with a valid certificate. After a rule is created, information about the rule is displayed on the remediation rules page. When you click a specific rule name, the summary of the rule execution status and information about the PCs on which the rule was triggered are displayed. The overview section displays a roll-up count of the number of PCs on which the rule was triggered. You can see the number of PCs on which no issues were detected and the number of PCs which issues were detected. It also displays the number of PCs that self-healed using the remediation script. This data helps you assess the number of PCs that self-healed using the remediation script and the number of PCs that need your attention. You can also modify the remediation script as necessary. The details section provides information about the PCs on which the rule was triggered. For more information about Support Assist for Business PCs, go to dell.com forward slash support assist. To view the documentation, go to dell.com forward slash serviceability tools. Click Support Assist and then Support Assist for Business PCs.